getting the opportunity to be out in the field and do the things that like actual researchers do has been a very gratifying experience. When you see the natural world, you become so inspired by it. And I really love that feeling. So being an intern last summer really gave me the experience to bridge the things that you learn in school to the real world. Um, so this experience just gave me so much more confidence in myself into how to you know, sit in meetings with professionals in the field that I'm wanting one day to be able to work with. And so it was really cool being able to um, come full circle and to, to work in Crystal Cove Conservancy and California State Parks. The role that California State Parks plays is we've been a big partner in framing this internship, working really closely hand in hand with Crystal Cove Conservancy staff to first identify what our needs are, um, what kind of staffing we're looking for, and what sort of succession we want to see through our program. And then we've helped frame the projects and identify what the goals of our internship will be. It's really important for our interns to connect with nature just because it's really um, kind of bridging what they've learned in school into a real life scenario. So right now we have two projects centered around the Emerald Fire. One of them is doing a trail camera study. So trying to figure out um, how wildlife is interacting with a burned site or an unburned site and see how you know, a burned area is affecting habitat in general. And then our second project is a vegetation monitoring project. So they're trying to do um, vegetation surveys, essentially trying to figure out how vegetation is resprouting post fire. What I'm hoping this internship will do is just basically help prep our next generation of environmental stewards. I think we need that more you know, now than ever. Um, but I think so long as these interns come out of this experience with a clear idea of how to navigate the environmental field. Interning for Crystal Cove Conservancy really provide me a invaluable experience on like trying to come up with your own projects. So each of us actually like have different ideas coming in and we also have different teams that are like Emerald Fire Team and a Wildlife Camera Trap Team. And all these things are like, we get to decide on ourselves. That's really empowering. When you're out in the field with a professional, you realize how amazing people really are when it comes to them working in their field, like how vast their knowledge is. And I think you also realize about yourself that you learn more quickly. It was a dream job that I heard about, like at the time and place being a student, you know, and I, I have another part-time job. I was incredibly excited because like that was my chance to actually get out there and like that, like my foot in the door, you know, and um, the fact that it was paid too, that kind of helped as well because a lot of times you can't take opportunities unless like there are instances like that. I get very excited when I see people that are, you know, getting this opportunity and focus that passion into something that's going to help state parks. I'm inspired by working with, with young people that are just getting into the field and really excited to see it and learn about it. That's the foundation. If, you, if you're curious and you're interested, then you're gonna care. And if you care, you know, you're gonna protect it. And that's what parks is all about.